so first of all let's try to understand the requirement so my uh, client has a product page so they wanted another page that will show the status of different products sometimes the uh, a product might be in maintenance sometimes a product might be degraded or something else so they wanted to show the product name and the status of that product in a different page their inspiration is uh, shopify status space and apple system status space and the out final outcome is this so this is the final outcome what i have created for them uh, this is application status space and uh, here we we see the different icons and product name and the current status of that product so let's see that how i do that um how i did that so uh, the first step is uh, I have created a uh, created a custom taxonomy. So by using that custom taxonomy, I'll show the uh, status of different product. So you see that uh, here is a taxonomy app status, uh, app system status, and the taxonomy. This is for the product post type. So the product is my uh, CPT. And I have add, added one meta field that is a status icon. So this meta field will help us to uh, add the different icons for different status. So now uh, come to the product and you see that there is a uh, additional custom taxonomy app status, app system status. And these are the different statuses of our product. But if, you, if I click on edit and you will see that every status has an icon so all the respective icon I have added for the for different statuses uh, for outers let's see this is the icon so then I created a page the page name is just a normal WordPress page the page name is uh, system application status so before going to that page, you need a listing. So we need to create a listing. So the listing will help us to display uh, what we want. So for, for displaying the icon of the uh, taxonomy, uh, I just drag and drop the image widget. And then from the dynamic tag, I have selected the taxonomy. So you see the all, all the uh, here is the taxonomy and our meta field is a status icon so how I find this meta field let's see that uh, if you if you go to the taxonomy then uh, go to the taxonomy we have created and then you will see that uh, here is the here is the name or ID so we, we need this field status icon so i pasted the status icon and it, it is displaying the respective icon and then we need the product name so the product name uh, i just simply drag a heading widget and then uh, selected the post title uh, you already know that uh, why i selected the post title because this will uh, grab the uh, product name and then uh, the status you know that the status is basically the the taxonomy name you see that when you uh, for your reference uh, when we um, when you move to the app system status you see that the, the status name is basically a taxonomy name so uh, I uh, drag and drop the dynamic term widget and then uh, select it for which taxonomy uh, for this taxonomy, I, I wanted to uh, show the term name. So the, that's it. And, and the listing settings, just select the listing source. And uh, you can keep the listing as a, it's a post listing or terms listing. I think the, both of both will work. Uh, just select the post type is product. So that's it. Then uh, here is the final uh, page where I have designed. This, uh, uh, I drag and drop the listing grid widget and select the uh, select the listing. That's it. So this is the final result, and I have shown the status using the image box widget. Thank you.